ladies and gentlemen, it's time. Episode 3. Elijah. <laughs> you hear me? Yo, what's up? Okay. It, it do the workington. Are you ready for episode 3, my guy? I am. I haven't seen episode 2 yet, but I saw that you... It's a whole ass movie, my guy. It's a <laughs> full-length it? fucking hour damn. and 35 damn near minute movie. Whoa! Yeah. Man, I haven't played Terraria since last time. Yeah, I, I hopped on uh, yesterday and did literally nothing but building. <laughs> nice. What I what I did what I did was um I made raw iron fences. <laughs> Ooh, raw iron fences. Yeah, and then I made some uh some lamp posts as well, and I just okay. kind of put them around my base. That's pretty much. Did you it. ever find the boots? Um, yes, I did find the Hermes boots. That's the very, very end nice. of the episode. Okay. And I did a little bit of building um under my base. I did like some, some beam work, I guess. So it okay. looks like it's more supported. Nice. So yeah, my base is looking pretty pimped out now. Light Spain. I'm gonna use that low key for the. Damn, fight. I'm down to one gold. That's sad. The, the light Spain leaves like a little trail. Yeah, it's pretty cool. The rework is really cool. So, I think I can probably hit out of Cthulhu while he's dashing. I need to make some damn potions, or take some potions if I have enough. We got archery and swiftness. Should I use the demon bow for just to just to use archery? Demon bow. I say I should. I was thinking about going for rage, <laughs> not rage, range class this time. Yeah. I don't know if I still want it or not. I was just thinking about it. I have already decided what I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna do it for this fight because this fight I already have all the weapons I need, pretty much. Um, and right. I just want to get it out of the way since you've already done it. But after yeah. this fight, I've already decided that I'm gonna go summoner. Oh, a summoner, nice. Cause I found I found a little thing. <laughs> a little thing. Yeah, I found a thing. What kind of thing? Uh, it's a, a summoner related thing that allows me to have mm. two summons. Oh, nice. Yeah. I can get those day blooms. Never mind. Oh, oh blood moon. Why, Come on. Why you gotta do me like this? <laughs> right when you're about to start fighting it. Minute 30 left. Until it's over. Blood moon is such a good event. Holy shit. Woo! It's the best. Woo Look at all these fucking zombies, <laughs> dude. I still haven't got right. a single good job. Except for money, well, I guess. Except for money, yeah, money's nice. This whole goddamn time, I could have been fighting a different kind of eyeball. A bigger eyeball. Hey, it's over. I'm so goddamn happy. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Now I have to wait an entire Ow. another fucking 12 minutes. <laughs> Just to fight the eye. Woo! We love this yeah, game. I've got three bloody tears if you want to do another blood moon. Oh fuck. <laughs> if you come over here you can peep the you can peep the new support beams and the raw iron fence and the lamp okay. posts. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the guide because I forgot how to build something. I went to the I went to the guide um in the very first episode and I asked him what I could build with iron and I said I was gonna make lamp posts and raw iron and... fences, so that's exactly Yeah, I remember what I that. <laughs> I also upgraded the tree a tiny bit. I just made like the little, I made some little branches with lampposts on them. Nice. For a little bit more ease of access. You can like actually walk through the tree now. You don't have to climb all the way up it. <laughs> Here's your tree. Oh cool, you added the lamppost to the tree. This looks sick. Rot iron fence. And there's a big smiley face in the post for whatever reason. I got bored. In the what? Down, down there in the post. Oh yeah, I see it now. <laughs> nice. I was just bored building this weird circle thing, and I was like, what if I made it a face? That's my face. That's it. That's sick. Oh, uh, here are the fences. I think the support beams ended up looking really sick. Yeah, they and do. The, the elevator rope. Does it go all the way down yet? No. Damn near. It's not all the way into hell, but you can get to the lava area. There, you can see a big okay. bottle of lava right at the bottom if you go down there. I didn't have enough bombs to go all the way through. You might plummet into it if you're not careful. 
Don't go too yeah, fast. I'm holding the rope. Yeah. <laughs> Don't let go of it though. <laughs> yeah. I accidentally jump off. It goes. I go straight to the desert. Yeah. All the way through the desert. Yeah. I managed to get through. It took me forever. Wow. Yeah, I've seen a couple of gravestones. <laughs> Hello, sir. He's ready for the smoke. I didn't put the bow. So he goes to your side. Yeah, oh, yeah, he's already there. I left the bow. <laughs> you left the bow! That's wow. Fine. I'm fast as fuck. <laughs> the one thing you were gonna use to fight it with, you left. I'm fast as fuck. I'm not fast <laughs> enough. Yeah. I checked the wrong chest for some reason, because I'm a big brain. All your NPCs are gonna start dying now. No, I'm too cracked for that. Alright, okay, I got the bow. I got the bow. Alright, now we can actually start the fight here. Honestly, this All is right, going pretty well. I do? I'm just gonna use the Jester's arrows to clear out the little dudes when he transforms, and then I'm gonna switch to the Boomstick probably for his last phase. The boomstick in the. You, you already found a Boomstick? Yeah. Nice. Boomstick's really fun. Oh, there we go. There's some damage. There's some damage. There's some damage with that thing. Yeah, the boomstick is really good. Alright. Now I'm hitting him with the boomstick. Oh my god, that damage is ridiculous. Oh, he just got hit by a fallen star. That's insane. What? No fucking <laughs> way. Got so lucky. That is ridiculously <laughs> lucky. Did that kill him or almost? Damn near. <laughs> I got him. Alright. Easy kill. Easy dubbington. And this starts our um, trophy area. Oh, I still need to make a trophy area. I just have mine. I just place it somewhere random. We're gonna put him down right there. I don't know, Roofington. All right, I need to craft actual armor now. Boom. All right. We got the shield of Cthulhu, finally. Finally, yeah. What a beautiful, beautiful fucking item. Dash, 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 dash. Shield bash. All right. <laughs> I am going to go explore the underground snow biome. And kill a bunch of flinxes, that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, for the cotton things? Or it's... not the cotton, but like it's fur. I want flinx fur. And I want a lot of it. I'm going flinx hunting <laughs> with my boomstick. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna blast them all. Yep. One fucking one shotgun shell to the dome piece, I'll tell you what. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, their whole body's like a dome piece. There's <laughs> <laughs> just one walking. Yo, dome. I got a boot statue. Ooh, fuck. Unlimited it. boots now. I wish. Yeah. <laughs> Even though it would be useless to. I will grab another heart lantern thing. Heart statue. Heart statue. Not you found them. You found you found more than one already. Not statue. Uh, crystal. Oh hey, there's a like, oh. chest. No fucking way. <laughs> what did you find? The fucking flurry boots. Are you serious? Are you? Huh. <laughs> Dude, this is what like flurry boots for? literally right. They're the they're the snow version of the Hermes boots. Okay. And they're literally thinking. like right next to my base. Like I shit you <laughs> no not. Way. Like, and you like have to go <laughs> the first goddamn cave in the snow biome next to my base. Wow. Like right next to a heart lantern or crystal that I somehow <laughs> nice. missed. Like I was and literally, I was literally right here, and I somehow missed this. That dude, I could have <laughs> had them so fucking long ago. That yeah, that funny. that last episode could have been literally not a, not a movie. If I if I yeah. just came over here. <laughs> and just yeah that, that's wow. terraria for you folks if you've never played this game that's exactly yep. what it's like it's basically a living nightmare but it's the funnest living nightmare you'll ever experience <laughs> yeah for real oh there's a nymph Ooh, nice in a pretty the best oh you can pretty, get metal detector pretty easy spot to kill i think yeah i usually try to find like a little cheese area where they can't hit me and i can just 
shoot it. Yeah, so. I got pretty lucky with this spawn, except for the fact that I just almost killed myself. It's fine. <laughs> nice. And that's how you cheese a nymph, ladies and gentlemen. Cheesing a nymph. Just holding down my superior flame. Cheesing a nymph. <laughs> These fossils? Oh no, shell piles. A shotgun sounds so cool. Oh, I should just I should just shotgun her. What am I doing? Oh god! Ah! There's so many bats. Can you guys fuck off? I actually might be dead here. I've done it. I've actually done it. I'm insane. You beat the nymph? No way. Yeah, right as you said that, I literally shot the last bullet into her fucking oh, nose. Nice. <laughs> I was just saying I did it as in I didn't die. Oh. I, was, I was literally like about 0.25 seconds from dying right there. <laughs> it's got a depth meter. You got a depth meter? Yeah. Oh. All I have. Oh, wait, no, I have a depth meter. Never mind. Oh, wow. You wouldn't believe what I just fucking got. What? Another set of flurry boots. <laughs> Another set, wow. I got moon lord legs. <laughs> hey, you found moon lord legs, nice. Yeah. I'm gonna put them on vanity, I guess. Cause... Yeah. <laughs> Cause they Cause look you don't cool. need them. <laughs> they look great. That's why. Look at them. I need flinxes, man. What does this game understand about the fact that I need flinxes? Oh! Right as I say that, I saw a flinx. <laughs> nice. Alright, I'm exploring again. I just have to mine too. Anyway. Oh, hello, flinx. I only have 60 torches? How is that possible? <laughs> I'm used to having like a thousand torches. <laughs> just craft some. I got more flinks. Yeah, I do. Ooh, I got five flinks for. I found a water chest in the spider biome. Nice. nice. And a trident. Okay. I already got one. Wow. That trident moment. Yeah. But oh, you can swim faster in water, though. <laughs> if you hold it. I got ten flinks furs now. How many do you need? I have no idea. You have, you're just trying to get as many as you can. Yeah, basically. Oh, guess what I guess what I just fucking found? One more boots. <laughs> warding flurry boots. Wow, warding. Hey, at least they have warding on them. Except for I already that's made different. Spectre boots, so. <laughs> oh, I got ice skates. Actually, that's kind of sick. Hey, that is kind of sick. Fucking something useful. Closer to making the Terrace Park boots. Yeah. So many bats that just keep coming. I'm just trying to get to this fucking chest. It's non stop bats, yeah. They're really annoying. They said, Oh, I see you're trying to loot a spider cave. Don't worry, we open. came we came to hit you a hundred and three <laughs> times. I mean, I think I need silk to make my own armor that I'm going for. Oh. Oh, for the armor you're trying to make? Yeah. Flinks. Is it armor that you're trying to make? Flinks fur coat and the flinks staff. Oh, okay. that shit. Oh, yeah, they're new summoning things, huh? Well, not too new, but... Semi-new, yeah. Did I make a demon bow? I don't know how much flinks furs I need, to be honest. I found only one more flinks. Where the hell are all the flinks is coming at? You know what? I'm just gonna click magic mirror. Fuck it. Cause um Can't I find any my inventory anyways. I need to see how many flinks the shits I need. Okay, so I need I've got plenty, okay. So I can make a flink staff and a flink's fur coat. How good is a flink staff? It's better than the the, than the pinch staff. stuff. Yeah, <laughs> I call it a. But I feel staff. like a lot of things are better than the pinch staff. Yeah, it's it's decent, I guess. It summons 
flinxes, as you would imagine, that yeah. bum rush oh, really? the enemy. We got the flink staff. Eight summon down. Nice. Oh, wait, nine summon. I got a mythical one. That's lucky. What? Lucky nice. First craft, I just got a mythical flink staff. And you got the best reforged. Wow. That's insane. Okay. Yeah. Well, let's go ahead and delete my finches and place these two, du two dudes down. Okay, they look pretty cool. They look pretty dope. They're, that they're was just really lucky. Alright. Now, we gotta make um, some silk. If I can find silk. it. Dude, Crimtain looks crazy. Crimtain bars look crazy. They yeah. Have been Is it a new sprite for them? Yeah. yeah. They have been utterly re-sprited. <laughs> yeah, it looks really cool. Like all the marbling. Yeah, okay. How do I make silk? Where's the silk? You need a loom. There it is. Yeah, I have a loom. I just couldn't okay. see it because there's so much crafting stuff. Okay, can I make flinks for a coat? Yay. One defense. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> One. <laughs> wow. Increases summon damage by 5% and increases max number of minions by 1. Mm. So. That's a thing. Alright, so I could either buy a leather whip or I could craft. I could go for crafting the um, jungle whip. Which I honestly think is a better idea. Crafting a whip? The jungle whip does more damage. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, all the jungle stuff is actually pretty good. But yeah, that's my next thing I need is a whip for summoner. Yeah, I just need two more vines. Okay, sick. And cue Skyrim NPC music. <laughs> Why? As I enter the jungle. Oh, yeah. It, oh, I forgot, yeah. It sounds just like Skyrim NPC music for some reason. <laughs> wait, it's not here. Hold up, wait, let me, let me, let me redo that bit. <clears throat> and cue Skyrim NPC music in 3, 2, 1. <laughs> Yeah, had to re-say it. It literally went so quiet. <laughs> it's, it's just, <laughs> it's so awkward. Wow. <laughs> this is in fact Skyrim NPC music. In case you guys didn't know. This is Skyrim NPC music. In case you guys didn't know. <laughs> nah, for real though, I'm actually dying at this shit because like, while I'm editing this, I was thinking about it and I was like, I gotta do an actual comparison. Like, I get it, unless you're living under a rock, you probably know what the, like, Oblivion and, like, Skyrim NPC memes are. But, in case you don't know, I'm gonna show you real quick. This is the type of shit I'm talking about, and this is literally the exact music for it, like. What's that? You would be impolite. About what? Oh, about anybody that says I love you after dinner and doesn't have your guitar. That sounds fine. I don't know what you mean. Well, little girl drinks more than you have to What the I fuck are you talking about? You're talking about babies. Yeah, babies don't usually eat dinner. Babies? <laughs> 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 okay. Jesus Christ. Like, the shit like that. That's what I'm talking about. But, like, this music right here, literally... The comparison to the literal song for the fucking jungle in the drunk seat here. You hear that shit? Like, such a similar vibe. Like, what are you talking about? That is insane. Hey, there is more than one beehive, and I think they're all really big. Oh, you're fighting him again. Nice. Yeah, I am. And two stars fell almost on him, but not really. I have officially dug my way into the be one of the beehives. Are you gonna fight the queen bee? Not yet. But at some point. Holy shit! This is like jarring how big this fucking thing is. <laughs> is it really that big? There's two beehives. There are two larva things. In one? Yeah. What? Well, what the I didn't fuck? know that was possible. What is this? Why is it? Why is it? Why is it built like that? <laughs> <laughs> what in the fuck? It looks like a giant middle finger down here. 
<laughs> Giant middle finger. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I got a vine. Die, man eater. I got the last vine. Let's go. Magic mirror time. Alright, so I should be able to craft Snapthorn now. Yay. Alright, we got our weapon. I'm gonna keep my shotgun and I'm gonna keep my sword for now. But I'm mostly gonna be using summon weapons from this point forward. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm doing too. I'm trying to use only the musket, but sometimes it's not the best. I got a whip. Of course it's shameful, that's good. <laughs> you got shameful. Well, you got mythical on your staff. Yeah, at least the staff is good. Yeah. I have to venture all the way to your base just to see the goblins, so I guess that's what I'll do. <laughs> I'm on my way to your base right now to have a word yeah. with a little specific little bald-headed fuck that's gonna run me for a lot of money, probably. <laughs> a lot of money. <laughs> Watch you get, like, shoddy or lazy. Shoddy like a melody. <laughs> <laughs> you want a shadow orb for free? A free shadow orb? Don't mind if I yeah. do. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> it's waiting right there because I don't at, want it. Look at my, my three flinxes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, nice. They're cute. Do they have tails? I don't know. What oh, they have like ponytails. Yeah, they look like huh. little samurai sheep or something. <laughs> yeah. I honestly can't tell what they Little are. samurai puffballs. Nice. And I got whip. Nice. Snap Does that have like any special effects or is it just regular whip? It, it, um, strike enemies to gain whip attack speed. So I guess if I hit with it, I can oh, hit nice. faster after I hit something. Yeah, the more you hit. And I do believe it has a chance to poison. Okay. And six summon tag damage. So basically, how whips work is when when you hit it, your summons will do more damage to the to the to the enemy that you hit specifically. Huh. I thought they were just a target uh, thing. Yeah, it targets and it and, and it improves damage that that your summons will do. So okay. if I hit if I hit something with it, my summons will do six extra damage to that thing that I hit. Huh. That's sick. Yeah, yeah, I haven't played. No way! <laughs> Whoa, you scared me. What? <laughs> I got fucking legendary on my first. What? Part. How are you getting so lucky? And you were just saying that you were super unlucky. <laughs> what is happening? And I was so way faster legendary too. Legendary snap thorn. Okay, well, that's cool. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you were just talking about how unlucky you were. For real. Everything. <laughs> everything turned around. Yeah. Oh, you were just here, and I forgot to give you the horse. Well, trade the horseshoe thing. Oh. <laughs> How about you trade me five gold for the lucky horseshoe? Five gold for a lucky horseshoe? Yeah. Take no fall damage. And you can combine it with a cloud, or no. Okay. We don't have a cloud. I got five gold in my inventory right now. You got five gold? Alright, I'll go towards you. Alright, I'm here. Here's the horseshoe. Hell yeah. And while I'm here, I guess I already have enough to buy a mini shark. Totally dope horseshoe moment. And I'm going to be super poor now. <laughs> no. Oh, I've got like two gold left. That sucks. Oh, God. Nothing left. Oh, nothing left. <laughs> <laughs> but I have a mini shark, which is actually really good. Hell yeah. Using my extractivator. I can make tin plating. Okay. What's tin plating for? It's, it's a building block. Oh. I think it looks cool. I'm gonna come over here and get to work on this, um. The bougie ice platform area. Alright, we're gonna see what this tin plating looks like. Whoa! It looks very interesting. Like, good interesting or bad interesting? <laughs> I'm not sure how to feel about it. <laughs> I can use the tin plating as like an interior. That's a good idea. Well, in order to actually be sold the pylon at this point, I need the arms dealer and the nurse, so... 
they're both getting. You have to move them. But there we go. Are you done with the house already? Yeah, the pylon building is set up and functional. Oh wow, that was fast. Looks pretty decent. It's not done yet, um, but it's the start to it. Yeah. Looks interesting. <laughs> Looks interesting, okay. So the extractinator is broken. Why? Would you get anything good? Um, I only have six platinum. I <laughs> uh, platinum coins? Yeah. What? Yeah. Wow. Just from extracting. I don't know how, but I do. Were you selling, or did you just get them from that? I, I was. Sell I sell a couple of shits, but. Hmm. I don't know. This is. I'm gonna have to watch back. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Bitch. Maybe I'll go get an extractinator. <laughs> We'll go grab that one from you. No Capitan, I am getting rich quick. That's it. Alright. I need to find it, okay. There you go. Oh, power fish. Okay. oh yeah, we got the arm stealer and the nurse. Yep. Snow pylon. Oh yeah, for real. I forgot. <laughs> I even like opened the shop too, didn't even see it. Boom, now I can teleport to your base. That's sick. Hey. Hell yeah. To the crimson. We're gonna toss one sticky bomb and see what happens. Please don't. So you don't get surprised like I did. <laughs> one more sticky bomb. Okay. One more sticky bomb. Oh, that's gonna blow it up, isn't it? Yep, okay. Yep, Brain of Cthulhu's awoken. Alright, well, I am. As ready as I'll ever, ever be, I guess. The whip is doing pretty good at keeping the creepers away, so that's nice. Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay. Chill. Chill. How did you get six platinum from silk? I literally have no idea. I, I was, I, all I know is I was extractinating and I looked at my screen and it said my character had picked up that much platinum and I was like, okay, cool. Wow. So I guess it's just really rare then. Yeah, I don't know. I think the brain's going down though. I think nice. I got this one in the bag. What's the health at? Oh, about 1,000. Okay. 900, 800. 500, 200, you're, hey nice, there we go, that wasn't that bad then, no, pretty easy, got the brain of confusion now, so that's fucking sick, we're gonna equip that right off the ripski dipski, I got hella tissue samples, which is the main thing I needed, yeah, you can grab the pickaxe now. Yes, sir. And the void bag. Void oh, bag. yeah, and the void bag, huh? That was kind of the main reason I wanted it. But yeah, the pickaxe, <laughs> too. The pickaxe is... Might try fighting the The pickaxe world. is also completely vital for progression. <laughs> what is? Pickaxe. <laughs> yeah. But you can also get the hammerhead shark, or the reaver shark, I don't remember what it's called. Actually, I, I think I think they nerfed that. Oh, they did. Yeah. Aw, that's what I was gonna. Go that's what I was gonna do. Okay. We got the brain of Cthulhu relic. Beautiful. I do also want to fight the worm at some point. The worm. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna I start making an arena for it. The traveling merchant has the dynasty. Um, Ooh, building blocks, building blocks. Yeah, if you want them. Hold on, I'm coming over. Yeah. I don't have six platinum, so I can't buy <laughs> as many as you can. God, I love that pylon. That is so helpful. Yeah. What up, my brother? Ooh, he has a crimson cloak. If only we weren't playing naked and afraid and we're gonna put on vanity sets that are <laughs> I know. 
But no, once we unlock the cloth here, we can mm. range. Should I? So, okay, so if I am going to go for the Hand of Creation this playthrough. If Wait, am, what's Hand of Creation? You were talking about it in the last episode, but you forgot what was it was I? called. Was I? Yeah, so I, there's a oh. part there's a part where I was walking through the crimson and I was like surface chest in the crimson, let's go and I opened it and I'm like step stool, fuck yeah and you were like Oh yeah You were like, Hey you can make the glove thing and I was like the glove thing <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I remember now. <laughs> yeah, that's that's called the hand of creation. I figured that okay. out. Okay. So I'm gonna go for that. I think I need the portable cement mixer, so I'm gonna buy that. I'm gonna buy these demon horns because You're gonna buy the demon horns. Yeah, they look cool. I guess. Imagine having six platinum. Look at those. Look at those. They look cool. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm gonna this buy is me right a, now. a lot of dynasty wood. Nothing else to spend it on. I'm gonna be building a lot in this place here, so. Okay. It'll be worth it. Okay, well, whatever. That's. I accidentally bought way more blue ones, but that's fine. Oh wait, he sells a painting. What is that painting? It's a cheese poster. I bought it. Cheese I like buying all, like all the poster. paintings and finding all the ones I can find. Getting all the ones I can find. I need to make um You know what? Actually, I do have a decent amount of wall space in my base. A small decent amount. I need to get more paintings. Yeah, I like collecting paintings. I guess I'll get the pizza poster. It's only 50 silver. It's a beautiful pizza poster. Okay, well, I'm gonna go to the jungle. And I'm gonna build with my new blocks that I just bought. The horrible chill goes down your spine. And a ball of hurt. <laughs> yep, I was so close though. This base is starting to look kind of interesting. Getting a log off. Beddington, Beddington. Sorts all my night. things. Alright. That was pretty good. That was like another really grind heavy episode. There was some action in there. We got some boss fights in. Yeah. A couple. Yes. Alright. Sick episode. See ya. Sick episode. Good night. Have a good one, mate. Yeah. Alright. Well, that's pretty much it. That's gonna be the jungle pylon. Um, I'm just again gonna use the good old fashioned. Why is this room too big? What do you mean? Okay. Well, at least those two rooms aren't too big. I'm gonna use the good old fashioned fucking. This combo. <laughs> the foolproof combo. And uh, yeah, it should go, on, uh, should go down without a hitch. As far as I'm concerned. Heard. I just realized there's this one piece of wall. It's gonna bother me. There. Okay. Now it's done. Alright. See y'all in the next one. Thanks for watching. This has been pretty epic.